I think it's I think it's our best product. I think it's the most unique thing on the road. And finally, the future will look like the future. The Cybertruck delivery event has just concluded, and those were all the impressive highlights that we've discussed about this polarizing vehicle. With an impressive range of up to 470 miles as officially announced on the Tesla website, and the latest variant Cyberbeast provides a power output of up to 845 horsepower. All of this starts at an impressive price of $49,890. It's a game changer for the electric pickup truck market, where the Cybertruck confidently showcases innovative design and features. The electric pickup race is over, and the outcome seems clear. What impressive items did Tesla reveal on Cybertruck Delivery Day? Let's find out in today's episode. Before we begin, please show your support by subscribing and ringing the bell so you won't miss out on any of our interesting videos in the future. Without further ado, let's get started. How much does the Cybertruck cost, and does it fit your budget? Elon Musk officially announced that the first three versions will be delivered to customers in the near future. And importantly, the delivery timing will depend on the pre-order position for the specific order you own. The first version, featuring a rear-wheel drive Cybertruck, is expected to be the most affordable model, priced at $60,990. However, for this variant, it appears that deliveries will commence in 2025 as the specifications of the two subsequent variants become clear. Next is the four-wheel drive variant of the Cybertruck with dual motors, priced at $79,990. Finally, the Tesla Cybertruck with three motors and the groundbreaking Beast Mode feature is priced at $99,990. All these prices seem to be significantly influenced by the high inflation rate over the past four years. According to estimates, the average inflation rate for pickups in the United States from 2019 to 2023 is around 28%. For instance, the typical Ford F-150, which Tesla is believed to use as a pricing benchmark for the Cybertruck, has increased from $49,700 at the time Elon Musk announced the Cybertruck's mid-range pricing to the current $60,400. Additionally, the rear-wheel drive and all-wheel drive variants of the Cybertruck receive a $7,500 tax incentive for having a price under $80,000, along with fuel cost savings of up to $3,600. This results in reduced prices of $49,890 and $68,890, respectively, for these two versions. In fact, you could potentially own a dual-motor Cybertruck as early as 2024. How did the great features we hope for in this Cybertruck appear? At the delivery event, Elon Musk announced the Cyberbeast Mode, also known as Beast Mode for Cybertruck. It featured a rear-wheel drive system with dual motors and a front differential lock, generating an impressive power of up to 845 horsepower. Additionally, the front drivetrain is equipped with an independent electric differential lock, producing 300 horsepower. As anticipated, this Cybertruck has the ability to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 2.6 seconds, showcasing its remarkable performance. In a drag race, it even outperformed the Porsche 911 literally as it carried another 911. You know this sports car weighs 3,042 pounds. Cybertruck's ability to outpace the Porsche was iconic. Furthermore, steer-by-wire is a feature that we've all been hoping to see on the Cybertruck, and now it's become a reality. The steering system will give you a sensation akin to piloting an aircraft thanks to its precise control and the ability to make sudden accelerations. Additionally, the official crash testing process has been unveiled, bringing a surprise as Tesla conducted a full frontal collision at a speed of 35 miles per hour and a side impact at a speed of 38 miles an hour. Following these tests, including an evaluation of rollover resistance, the Cybertruck appeared to remain robust and stable in the face of all these impacts. What makes Cybertruck's operating range more impressive? The Cybertruck will be manufactured at Giga Texas and will utilize the 4680 battery cells and structural battery packs architecture similar to the Model Y. To achieve a range standard of over 340 miles and a potential range of up to 470 miles, it truly stands out as an impressive electric pickup truck. 
However, before making a decision to purchase it, let's take a look at how the future charging infrastructure for Elon Musk's electric pickup trucks will unfold. Tesla is rapidly deploying the Supercharger V4 network across the United States. After its debut in Europe earlier this year, the V4 charging stations are becoming increasingly available in various states. They've been spotted in Oregon, Nevada, Alabama, and Georgia, with an estimated number exceeding 2,000 charging stations. Previously, we witnessed the improved design of the V4 supercharger stations. They come equipped with the Integrated Magic Dock or CCS1 adapter. This charging system has the capability to replenish 136 miles in just 15 minutes, explaining the extended range that Tesla has announced in specifications. The V4 charging network will facilitate the Cybertruck in reaching an 80% charge in approximately 30 to 35 minutes during a rest stop. What you need to do after the Cybertruck is delivered. All right, we're sure the first thing that you want to do with your new Cybertruck delivered to your garage is to take it on challenging roads and test its off-road capabilities. Maybe even do some other crazier things that we haven't thought of. You can share your ideas about what you want to do with the vehicle first in the comments. However, checking off the list is actually the first and necessary step when you have the possibility of receiving a massive order of a Cybertruck from a delivery person. The first category you need to pay attention to, which is also something most of us need to consider, is the gaps on the dashboard. Check if there are any issues with fit and finish. You might easily overlook any imperfections or just dismiss them with excitement. But small issues may still appear here, and Tesla will certainly address any existing problems. The important thing is to point them out on the delivery day so that Tesla knows it's a manufacturing issue rather than the usual wear and tear over a long period after delivery. We don't want your Cybertruck to look like test versions with significant deviations in the steel panels. Moreover, fortunately, these stainless steel panels don't require any additional protective film like PPF. In all previous models, we always had concerns about the vehicle's pain over time. Next is the impressive air suspension system, which will make it easier for you to conquer challenging terrains. When the driver opens the Cybertruck door, then sits in the driver's seat and starts the Cybertruck, the entire suspension system begins to raise from low to medium ride height. So you need to check the seamless mode transitions to ensure that the Cybertruck doesn't encounter any glitches. Any issues reported to Tesla may arise within 72 hours or 100 miles, depending on whichever condition comes first. But Tesla will be lenient in addressing them immediately after delivery. However, it's best to detect any discrepancies or issues early to ensure they'll be rectified. Of course, activate the Cyber Owl feature immediately. And it's great that this feature can be displayed on the infotainment system screen when Sentry Mode is activated. It's a unique factor that adds an extra touch of personalization to the already outstanding interior experience of the Cybertruck. It's delightful to see Tesla adding a cup mode for those who want to leave their pets in the Cybertrucks and don't want others attempting to throw metal balls at the Cybertruck's windows to test the bullet-resistance glass that Elon Musk once proclaimed. When will Cybertruck be widely available? Tesla is facing significant challenges in scaling up Cybertruck production. Musk told investors during an earnings call in October, Tesla may ultimately overcome what CEO Elon Musk described as substantial challenges in mass producing the Cybertruck without burning through cash and eventually the Cybertruck is delivered. However, Musk himself estimated that it would take between 12 to 18 months to complete the job. Furthermore, Tesla is unlikely to achieve an annual production rate of 250,000 Cybertrucks until around 2025. Do you remember an analyst who went even further by suggesting that the company should scrap the vehicle, saying that it could be beneficial for Tesla stock? Not at all. Just within one day of the delivery date announcement, the Cybertruck's hype caused the stock value to surge from $235 to $252. You can imagine how, in a few days, the presence of this electric pickup truck in the city will contribute to Tesla's success. There are very few visionaries in the world. Even fewer are those who are honest and open-minded about the prospects of their own exciting projects. Musk has his own class, and the world is truly fortunate to have him. Even in failure, 
he'll learn something to apply to the next product. What information did you receive from the delivery event? Please feel free to give your opinions about Cybertruck, and we hope you'll have the most relaxing feelings after watching this video. If you did, please hit the like button and join the Tesla Car World family by subscribing to our channel. And don't miss out on any of our awesome videos by hitting the bell icon. We value your feedback and your time. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon. Until then, stay safe and have fun.